Welcome to another installment of Sanctified with a Psalm. Today we're looking at Psalms 133 and 134 because they're nice and short. The hymn is going to be Hymn 854 from the Lutheran Service Book. That's Hymn 854 from the LSB. Grace and peace be to you from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ who went to the cross for us, who shed his blood for us, who washed us clean in that same blood by those holy waters of our baptism to declare us a kingdom of priests to serve God and his Father to him. Be all glory, honor, and dominion. This is most certainly true, so let it be for all of us who confess the same and therefore are blessed by God our Lord and Savior. My name's Pastor Gordon Alman of Trinity Lutheran Church in Scarsdale, New York. You can find us at trinityscarsdale.org. Let's read the Psalms. Behold how good and pleasant it is when brothers dwell in unity. It's like the precious oil on the head running down on the beard, on the beard of Aaron running down on the collar of his robes. It's like the dew of Hermon which falls on the mountains of Zion. For there the Lord has commanded the blessing life forevermore. Come, bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord, who stand my night in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands to the holy place and bless the Lord. May the Lord bless you from Zion, he who made heaven and earth. Again, by day or by night, because the Lord who neither slumbers nor sleeps is always watching over us. So we respond with joy with him. 854. Forth in thy name, O Lord, I go, my daily labor to pursue. The only thee resolve to know in all I think or speak or do. The task thy wisdom has assigned, O oh, let me cheerfully fulfill. In all my works thy presence find, And prove thy good and perfect will. Thee may I set at my right hand, whose eyes my inmost substance see, and labor on at thy command, and offer all my works to thee. Give me to bear thine easy yoke, and every moment watch and pray, and still to things eternal look, and hasten to thy glorious day. For thee delightfully employ whate'er thy bounteous grace has given, and run my course with even joy, and closely walk with thee to hell. So we pray. Lord, forgive me, a sinner. Lord, remind me of your suffering and pain, your stripes, your very death by which I am healed. Remind me that it is your sacrifice that is my salvation. And Lord, sanctify me in the same. By this truth, your word is the truth. And as the truth promises to set me free, so it is your word sets me free. At last, free from worry, free from anxiety, free from all the worries that would overlay us as we realize and see and remind ourselves and just repeat and echo that bigger picture of the Lord's governance and guidance and with Isaiah's great word of comfort to us. That is the word of the day. Comfort, comfort you, my people. 
The Lord bless the rest of your day and keep you in his joy and peace. And perhaps we'll see you next time for another episode of this series, Sanctified with a Psalm. Take care.